Hello puzzle lovers and welcome back. Today we are going to solve a very unusual sequential discovery puzzle made by famous Australian designer Junichi Yananose aka Juno. This puzzle is his latest creation and considered the most difficult sequential discovery puzzle he designed. Named SDBB Master, which stands for Sequential Discovery Bird Box, this puzzle looks like a six piece bird. In reality, it is made up of six boxes and you have to find tools along the way to solve this puzzle and find the hidden treasure. I know you are as excited as I am to see this puzzle. So let's start to solve the SDBB Master by Juno. And here it is is the SDBB Master by Juno. Look at the size of this burr looking puzzle. So I solved this six piece burr puzzle before on my channel and <laughs> just take a second to compare these two puzzles. I mean, this thing is 10 times bigger than this little puzzle just here. That's so crazy. Wow, I really love the color of the wood. Like, this puzzle is really beautiful and the ends of the pieces are also so well done. That's such a nice sequential discovery puzzle. I mean, the idea is so nice. So, the goal of this puzzle, uh, step one is separate the six boxes because yes, each piece is a box. It doesn't seem like this right now, but it should be a box and there should be something hidden inside. So step one, separate the boxes. Step two, open all the boxes. And step three, find the hidden treasure. Let's do that. I'm sure we will enjoy this puzzle so much. So I don't believe that this is a normal bird puzzle. You can really see that all pieces are different. Okay, so these two are kind of locked with a magnet or something. I don't think the other pieces separate like this. Yeah, no, they're quite stuck. But these two, yeah, these two are locked with a magnet and something else. Okay, so uh, maybe that's the first step. Okay, yeah, it's moving. It was moving. It's moving. Yeah, we have our first Step, that's so cool. Look at the details of this puzzle. Wow, but that's so nice. There are a lot of different things and inside there, there are some pins. I don't know if you can see them. And as I was saying, you see this piece will have a compartment where something will be hidden inside. And that's quite nice that you have two different colors of wood. That's really a nice touch. Okay, so we have this first piece that we move. Uh, you see that maybe is the lock you have to be so careful of everything you see okay so let's just check that okay so we put it back and maybe if we move it like this it's locked and on the other side you unlock it so there is a pin like a big pin locking it now now we have to be careful okay so there is something that is spring loaded just here this thing cannot come off but when you move it you can see there is like a rail or something so maybe if we push this one and push yes look at it and you can remove it now hey we have our first piece <laughs> look at the size again i'm so amazed the size of one piece of this puzzle is still like two times bigger than this little puzzle okay uh, look at this. Wow, that's so beautiful. So that's a magnet, I believe. That's a magnet that was looking to this. Yeah. And now you have this spring-loaded button and you have this compartment. But we need to open with something just here. So let's continue. We need our first tool, but hopefully maybe it's here. That's the pin that was looking this piece at the beginning. Hey, look at that. You have your first tool. Okay. So we will use this tool to push this here. And then we can remove the compartment. Oh, that's so nice. Look at that. That's spring loaded to lock. And so with a pin, you will push it 
to align the top and bottom faces and so then you can remove the first compartment so nice okay so we have our first tool and we end up with a second tool that's a screwdriver wow that would be so amazing if there are a lot of different tools to use as well okay so also we have this one that could fit here maybe that's too early to use that yes nothing will happen no okay let's forget that for a second can we remove it still not still locked with something else interesting can we remove something else maybe maybe not not yet but very interesting okay so we have so many things being revealed in this puzzle so we have this screwdriver and we have something to use it here let's do that what will happen if we hey that's a magnet as well and we can remove our second piece wow wow that's so cool yeah you can see this is magnetic and you use the screwdriver to remove this i would say uh it's like a, a, a pin lock something like this that's so nice okay so we have our second piece and we might be able to remove other stuff already so we can remove this one now what was ah uh, there is something here that is locking it okay we have to be so careful to be able to reassemble it later so we have this quite huge and heavy piece and then everything will not yet not yet okay so let's do one thing at a time so we did everything with the first box that was the second box okay so let's try to see if so there is this compartment here maybe you can use a magnet there is a magnet here there is more than one magnet there are three magnets hey <laughs> so you have to use the strongest magnet among them to be able to remove this part just here that's really cool okay let's maybe also put back the different leads on the different compartments so we don't get lost later so we have a magnet a pin a screwdriver and now what do we have we have oh that's an interesting tool look at the shape of this tool that's so cool and that is perfect for that that's where we will use this tool later but let's go back to this one we want to put back the lid on it so we don't mix the pieces later and now we have this box i wonder if this box how do you know which box is the last one uh, i don't think we want to go too fast and open already the last box you see there are magnets again here and here but obviously we will have to use something later maybe it's not a good time yet to play with this box so we will leave it here for now and we will use the tool from the second box to open that and this tool when you use it you can see this pin going down and it's blocked by this other wooden pin just here so that's very interesting how do we get rid of this pin I can push the pin and I can turn. Okay, so is that a valid move or not? That's the question. I mean, that is a perfect fit. You can push the pin and then you can turn this circular lid now. And you can open the lid very nicely. Let's say that. <laughs> okay uh, let's say that's a valid move and that we should do that at this point uh, i don't see anything else to do the opening is a square and i can fit my screwdriver in it i finally open this lid and you see the pin went up i can remove all of it 
Okay, so that was a lock for this pin to go up. And now I can remove my three last pieces. Yes, wow, look. I'm so amazed by the work involved in this puzzle. That looks so beautiful, so neat. And that's, uh, that's nice. That's the key, I guess, maybe, that we need to use later. That would be fun. That's a nice pin. I like the different shapes of objects, the tools, the, the leads. That's so nice. I really enjoy this puzzle so much. That's really cool. Now we have four boxes that still need to be open. So these two are done. And now, next one. Next one, I don't know which one would be the next one. But something that we need to find out. And we have this kind of cuts now. Yeah. And these cuts will make us open these compartments. And then we have this one. So this one, I think, will open. Oh, sorry. There is something here. Maybe I can use that. Yes. Oh, that turns. That's the key. And now. And now you use the magnet to open it. This magnet is quite practical. I like it. Okay, so uh, you see, this is a magnet, I believe. Yes, this is a magnet. And so you turn it to get rid of it. What's that? That looks so nice. Kind of a bat or something, no? That's so cool. Okay, I'm really amazed with every little step that we are making. I love your work, Juno. You know? So smart, everything is so nice. We have a bunch of tools now. Look at that, like I have so many tools to use to open each compartment. So we opened a third box, which is quite nice. And we are left with these three last boxes. So this one, we are missing some, a lot of stuff for this one, I fear. Now this one, we have this, does that fit? No, that will not fit, but this will fit. No, this will not fit. <laughs> okay, so maybe it's too early. Maybe the tool that we'll find here will fit in this. Okay, so we need to open that. And to open that. We have different options. So we have this big cut. And there is like a, a triangle inside. It kind of shows two ways to go this fits oh wait how would i use this tool okay let's try to think yeah i'm afraid to push too much uh, and to break the tool or the mechanism inside you can see like so the, what i can see is there is a triangle like this and so you have two openings here and here and also in these openings there is something oh i can i can push them okay you have to not be too yeah scared to use the tool please 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 so i push you well i can I can open it now if I want by using this other tool and let's see how it works. That's a thick panel. That's a really thick panel. So nice. So many magnets in this puzzle. Okay, so look. So that's the mechanism I could kind of see inside. And so if you push one with a tool, it doesn't stay. You can push. I. It doesn't really stay. The lock cannot stay locked like this so you have to use two tools to open it it's a bit sad i wish they could stay like this both of them and then you will open the lid that would have been nice but yeah interesting mechanism right the tool that looks like a bat is so smart it's so well designed to enter perfectly and to push the lock. That's really a smart tool and quite original. 
Okay, so we have another tool. Wow, we have so many right now. Uh, okay, so let's put back this so we know that this goes there and we have one more box solved. So, left with two boxes, uh, yes. Okay, so we have this tool that goes there and seems to be like this. So we can turn like this. What should we do? I'm quite scared that I'm going to open the last box before this box. But I don't have any tool that fits in that, uh, like zero tool. So I don't think... I don't think I'm taking any risk by opening this box first, but this box really is heavy. It's the heaviest among all of them. So I'm scared that the price is in this box. If it's the case, uh, I would be quite sad to open this box before this one. What do you think? I feel that that's a tool. How do we open this one? Should we try to open this one? For this one, I cannot see anything inside. Like there is a big hole that just goes down at the bottom bottom. I couldn't see anything. I used the light and we really like it goes down until there and then there is like an opening here, but I cannot see what's there. So wait, what if let's do that? So we combine these two tools. Really smart by the way. I like the way to get a key with two tools. Uh very original. Now we put this inside and we turn. Okay, so something is locking then let's say that we use this one to push but we cannot push yet because this thing is locked and if i use that doesn't come off we need to use three tools to open this last compartment i do feel it's the last compartment let's try to not burn any stage here. How do we open this box? <laughs> if you have any idea, just put it in the comments. That might be a bit late for me to see it, unfortunately, but never know. Maybe you will figure out what to do before I do. Just try to practice your puzzling skills and maybe you can put like, hey, if you use this tool and this tool, then you should be able to open your compartment. Okay, I was just thinking, but imagine if you need to use one lid to open it. Do you think? Is that a good solution? I mean, it fits. I hope I will not lose my lid. <laughs> that will be sad. That will be interesting if you can use one of the lids open the next compartment wait let's try another one we never know right we have so many possibilities this one doesn't fit okay so that's nice what do I do I really have no idea what to do that's so crazy and i hope you are enjoying the video so far that you enjoy the puzzle first time to try juno's puzzle and bear really neat puzzles oh that's really interesting so you can put your key inside okay so i need to show you but okay so you put your key inside okay you turn you can feel that you are pushing something but then if you pull the key up it seems that you can lock it and you can unscrew your two tools and now you can use this one to push here so you push, you push here and 
if you do that, I wonder if you can open this. It's almost coming. Uh, maybe there is something else that needs to be done. I'm missing something here. But I don't know what. Okay, so I think I found out what to do with this box. So you have this key, but you need to put here, obviously. And there are two possibilities inside this key hole. You have the one that we went through at the beginning. So you put the key all the way down and then you push and you can feel that something is spring loaded. Then you can put it up and lock the key. But at the beginning, instead of putting the key all the way down, you keep it at a middle level and then you can push to reveal this hole. Finally, you can use this. That's great. So you lock this first part. Then you use your key, put it all the way down, push, pull, and unscrew the tool. Now you unlock two locks. And the final stage is to push this pin here, and then you use this magnet to remove the lid. And you finally open this box. Now, this is a complex box. <laughs> you have to use uh, a lot of tools. At least four, four tools. And I'm worried that this is the end, but we solved the puzzle without opening this box. Let's see, maybe we will find the final tool to open this box, but I doubt it. Yes, I knew it, but we solved this puzzle. Uh, amazing, amazing puzzle. Look at this. The mechanism inside your two screws that lock two different locks you have that's so nice you have the name of a designer juno and you have your final prize your trophy with a bag with some smiley faces printed on it and an infinity charm so nice that's so cool wow i spent so much time uh, figure it out what is the mechanism of this final box. I'm really sad that we didn't open this one. I want to open the other box. We don't finish this video without opening this box. I wonder what tool I will find inside. So let's put this piece all back together. We saw the inner mechanism and we saw this box. So nice. Uh, put it in the comment. What do you think about the charm that we found at the end, the mechanism that is so smart, you have to use four tools. That's so crazy. You have to assemble the key, disassemble the key, use this pin tool, use the magnet. So, so smart. So clever mechanism. Okay, so we put it back all together. We close it. We hide again our nice charm and we remove everything. Okay, so we remove everything even this one like this so we have this nice box uh, i love this box so much the final mechanism is so crazy now i really have no clue what to do with this one moments later it is working you have to use these two leads that's so crazy wait i'm feeling a bit sad <laughs> right now but you can push and you can feel ah. ah and you can open this one wait you have a second um wow wow i didn't expect that so we open this box correctly but we didn't open this box correctly if we put back this box like this now we can use these two kind of bats but wait, can I? Okay, like this, and like this, and like this, and wow, 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 wow. <laughs> That's so smart, wait. <laughs> you don't need any magnet. We took a lot of shortcuts to solve this puzzle. Uh, now, now everything makes sense. Wait, so that this thing you can assemble them to make one nice sweet 
tool and just push them and open this box okay okay fair enough <laughs> that's so crazy so i should have opened this box before this one i'm so amazed by the different tools the use of each of them so smart you are so clever mr juno so now we can put back everything together um hopefully we will manage to not mess up with where the tools were And now I can put back my final box in like this. Please go inside. Yes, I put it back like this and I lock back my puzzle. Yes, Woo! amazing puzzle. Such a great sequential discovery puzzle. So much fun, so many tools so smart way to use each of them you have to think about using the leads of all the compartments so many things are happening i'm so amazed by your work juno and i am so glad to say that the sdbb master has been solved and another puzzle solved and just let's take a second to admire this beauty this puzzle is amazing. A lot of different tools and the way to solve it is just an amazing journey. I loved this puzzle so much. I'm so happy that I finally got the chance to try one of Juno's puzzles. A wonderful puzzle with a lot of thinking to try to solve it. I loved the challenge to solve this puzzle. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to put a like don't forget to subscribe as well it will help me so much and i will be able to show you more of this kind of crazy amazing wonderful puzzles now i see you next week for a new video tschüss